Jackson, 430. Now at 430, a miniature miracle at a South Florida hospital. Doctors working on an infant with a broken heart. This baby boy, under a month old. And already pulling through a complicated procedure. Richard Jordan is live at Miami Children's Hospital with the details. Richard? Charles, this is an extremely unusual heart condition. Doctors here had never encountered anything like it, and they had to go to some pretty extreme measures to correct the problem. Let's take you into some video. This is Anthony Casal. He, he is just 29 days old. He had open heart surgery yesterday. He was born in Italy. That's where his father is stationed with the U.S. Navy. Just a couple of weeks ago, he went to a routine doctor's appointment, and that's when they discovered his heart defect. Essentially, the arteries to his heart were backwards. After talking with relatives here in Miami, the parents decided to bring Anthony here to Miami Children's Hospital. They had this very delicate surgery yesterday, and they were able to repair his defect. Cardiologists used part of a cow's neck in order to fix the problem. They say they've never heard of this being done before, but they've never encountered a heart defect like this. The baby is doing okay. He's in stable condition, and that has brought a lot of relief to Anthony's parents. I could not believe that we heard that he's going to have a, a open heart surgery. A baby. We were like, she was crying, and I was crying. We, we told our families, everybody was like in shock. When we realized we had to replace the pulmonary valve, we, we, we had to think outside the box. And the idea we came up with was one of the cow neck veins would be about the right size for Anthony's heart. So we put that in, and I, I'm not aware of anyone ever doing that before. This little boy is expected to make a full recovery. He's going to be here in the hospital for the next few weeks. His family has already decided to move from Italy here to the United States. They are expecting only the best for this little boy. On top of the jugular from the cow that was used in this operation, there was also a heart that had been donated from a child who passed away that was used also in this very successful surgery. Reporting live in Southwest Miami-Dade, Richard Jordan, 7 News. Oh.